basic cheese omelet. So we're using two eggs. We're gonna season that with some salt and pepper. And we're gonna whisk them up. I'm just gonna use a fork. Now we're just gonna add a little bit of butter. You can use coconut oil, you can use avocado oil, olive oil, butter. You can use cooking spray, whatever works for your diet or what you like. One of my favorite tools to use for making omelets or eggs is a heat resistant rubber spatula. And I really like this one because it has a curve on it. So our butter is melted, we're gonna add in our eggs. The heat should be on about medium to high. Okay, you can see our eggs are starting to cook. You'll see they start to bubble up a little bit and you can see the parts that are cooking in there. We're just gonna take our handle of our pan and gently tilt it back. And using your spatula, you're gonna lift up the cooked egg and let the other run under it. You can see there's a hole there. And you're gonna continue to do this until all of the raw egg is pretty much cooked. So now what you're gonna do is you're actually gonna flip this over. You're gonna add your cheese in and now we're gonna flip over this side here And you can just sprinkle a little on top. What I like to do is get a little bit of water and just add it to the pan. Just a little bit. You wanna create the steam to help melt the cheese. You can also cover this with a plate and that will help melt the cheese. Our omelet is done. You can just give it a little shake to loosen it from the pan. Just put it on your plate and there you have it. There is a basic cheese omelet. I like to add a little bit of green onions to mine. And also, you can add some hot sauce. I like to use this taco sauce from Trader Joe's. This stuff is so good. It's not spicy at all though. I don't care for spicy products. And this is really, really good.